When it comes to treating sensitive skin, there's more than just skincare that we need to do. Unfortunately, you know, we need to give that skin all the tools it can possibly have. So yes, by applying it, but also by putting it into this body so the skin cells can draw from this. Now, of course, my go-to when it comes to supplementation and a healthy lifestyle and healthy diet is Patrick Holford. And from his book, The Optimum Nutritional Bible, which I use as a reference all the time, he recommends that if your skin is sensitive or you suffer with any skin like sensitive diseases or disorders, this is what you need to supplement with on a daily basis. Look for a good like multivitamin that's got minerals in and vitamins and of course high in antioxidants. So most of your vitamins like an E, C, A, those are all antioxidants. Of course, you can even look for something that's got some bioflavonoids in because bioflavonoids ordinarily are antioxidants as well and they're great to strengthen capillaries because most of the time when you are sensitive, you could even get those little broken capillaries. Besides that, he also recommends to supplement with a good quality vitamin C because again, vitamin C helps to make collagen. Collagen is great for the skin. It gives the skin that strength. But also, remember, we find collagen in the capillary walls. So again, if you're prone to broken capillaries, that can strengthen those capillaries for you. Also supplement with gamma linoleic acid as well as vitamin E. So what you're giving your skin is nourishment from the inside, nourishment from the outside, and lots of antioxidants and minerals to strengthen that skin so that your skin can work at optimum level. But remember, when you start a supplementation, you've got to be consistently taking it morning and evening. And you also got to make sure that you use it for at least three months consistently before you will see the difference in the skin, the hair and the nails.